Well, Richie McCaw, this has been a dream for a long, long time. You put your heart and soul into this team. They all have. How are you feeling? Oh, mate, I, I hard to describe. I, I'm absolutely shagged. I like the courage and uh, what the guys put in out there. We just had to dig as deep as we've probably ever dug before. And, you know, it's hard to really let it sink in, but um, oh, I'm just so proud of every single one of the guys. Uh, you know, we couldn't have been under more pressure there at times, and uh, we stuck tight, stuck to our guns, and, uh, you know, we got there in the end. I think, you know, at some stage, some team was going to do it, and this group of 30 had the opportunity this year, and, you know, you've got to be warriors to win this. You've got to keep getting up and keep getting up, and uh, when things come at you, just keep getting up and believing in your mate beside you, trusting him to do his job, and making sure you do yours. And, you know, from 30 guys plus the management, everyone did their part, and, uh, I don't know, it's hard to describe, but the people, and around New Zealand have given this team so much this last six weeks and just thankful we could repay them. Alan Wynne Jones, captain of Wales. I know not the result you're obviously looking for or wanted, but just tell me about the fight in this team all tournament long. Um, I, I think we showed it today. Uh, we stayed in the arm wrestle. Um, they are proud of us when we went 16 uh, all, but obviously um, we probably piggybacked the penalties down the park and uh, South Africa took advantage, so uh, congratulations to them. You've been a warrior for this jersey over a long period of time. I mean, for you, what does it mean to play in their scarlet jersey? Oh, well, today we fell short, but, um, you know, hopefully get another opportunity. Uh, we just, like I say, it wasn't our day. Um, but I'm still proud to uh, pull this jersey on and represent all the people in red in the stadium. It was very disappointing, especially for you with your last test. Uh, it uh, was one that defence maybe sometimes wasn't holding up. Oh yeah, the New Zealand is kind of good attack, attack employees. Uh, some of our defensive uh, structures we didn't uh, get, get to par. But uh, then again, we didn't play our game plan and we didn't have the ball to play with. The, there was a lot of times in the game where you guys had opportunities and uh, a few turnover balls, but didn't capitalise. You've got to use your chances in Test Match Rugby. No, definitely. That's what the game is all about, especially in World Cup. You have to focus, you have to focus on everything you do. Um, we didn't. Uh, too many lost balls and uh, we paid the price. Just disappointment today for you, but congratulations on a great test career and thank you what you've done for rugby. Thank you, Kovis. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Congratulations. I can see that you've got tears in your eyes and you're very emotional. Um, I guess that's because of what happened at the last Rugby World Cup and how hard you guys worked. Yeah, that was definitely on our mind from 2014, but new team in 2017. I, I'm so proud of the girls. We dug deep. Full credit to England. They really gave it to us in that first 15, 20 minutes. But our girls just today built our character and our team, our culture and our team, and I couldn't be any prouder. I mean, we had to really dig deep. Um, we said to the girls, you've got to really go into deep, go dark places and really fight for your families, and that's what they did today. Future of women's rugby for New Zealand, how's that looking? Oh, it's looking bloody awesome, Melody. You know, the girl, there's a lot of girls playing rugby these days, and for these girls to be the role models for our future, I, I'm just amazed, and I, I'm so excited. Well done. Thank you very much. And thank you to everyone back home for your support. We love you guys. And now for you, you've been probably one of the greatest All Black coaches. I mean, 15 years in this All Black environment, two Rugby World Cups. How has it been for you to be a part of that? Thank you very much, Coach. Thanks. 14 years in that green jersey. 124 caps you've given to it. I'll leave the last word for you, Cap. <laughs> yeah, look, I've loved every minute of it. Um... <laughs> take your time, take your time. Look, I've, I've loved every minute of it. Um, like I said at the start, the crowd have been fantastic. The support that I've got from home, um, from the fans when we're at home, when we're away, um, my teammates, um, the coaching staff, and probably in particular Joe as well, who, who's moving on. I think he brought Irish rugby and, and probably my game in particular to a different level when he came here. And uh, a lot of credit must go to him and just a massive thanks to him. And I suppose good luck to Kieran and, and the All Blacks next week.
You have got a smile on your face for a good reason. How are you feeling? Uh, I'm really proud of my country. We're not the biggest, we're not the tallest, but we came here to win. We are preparing this since four years, so I'm really proud of my country. We are working since we qualified. We are working on this. Uh, we, we never had anything granted. Uh, we always have to qualify first and then come to the World Cup. So since we qualified, we are thinking about this game. And you saw the passion. You saw. I'm, I'm really proud. Thanks for all the people that are here and all the ones that came up early to see the match. Say hi to them that believe in us. I think I don't want this to end. This is your second man of the match. This is getting very easy for you. Uh, Matches uh, effort by all the team players. We can see the emotion. What does this mean to you and, and, and the Japan? Uh, the emotion is uh, very strong. You are our master. You are the master card man of the match. Many congratulations. Just feel very unfortunate that um, we couldn't achieve quarter final, which was our ultimate target. Well, you are a must-card man of the match, which means you get a trophy here for you. Congratulations.